turn our attention now to one of Texas's top high school quarterbacks, now in his third year as a starter at Rockwall and a, res a re deserving recipient of this week's MVP bobblehead. Since he burst onto the scene in 2019, Braden Locke has been one of the area's top passers and most exciting players. This year he's picked up right where he left off last season when he threw for 3,600 yards and 40 touchdowns. Those kind of numbers have drawn the attention of the top colleges across the country. After graduation, Locke will continue his career playing for Mike Leach at Mississippi State. And Braden joining me now in studio with his new bobblehead. We're watching him throw some dimes there. <laughs> well, what do you think of the new bobblehead, man? Man, it looks good. You got you nailed it on this one. For well sure. deserved. It's been so fun to watch you play for the last few years. I told you a little bit ago, it feels like you've been the quarterback at Rockwell for a decade. I mean, starter <laughs> since your sophomore year. How has that helped you in your development now, playing so much, and now as a senior, you're playing great again? Right. I think just uh, the amount of experience. Uh, that I've been able to get over the last three years has been huge. Uh, it, it truly slows the game down. Uh, the more games that you get to play and the more uh, snaps that you get, uh, it just it helps so much when you get to this point uh, in your high school career. And so I'm really thankful uh, for the time I've had at Rockwall, and I think it'll also benefit me big at, at Mississippi State. And then the offense, man, it's just so fun to watch you guys play. What's that like inside that locker room right now, the energy that you guys feel and the confidence that you guys have? Right, it's just it's a ton of selfless guys. Uh, you know, I'm so blessed to, to get to be surrounded by such great receivers, such great offensive linemen, uh, running back that is fearless on every play. Um, and, it, and it all starts with our coaching staff. I truly believe that we have one of the best coaching staffs in the state. Um, those guys work harder than anybody. Uh, they put in so much time. Uh, they invest into us so much. And so we couldn't be luckier as players to get to be around them each week. He likes his coach, Trey Brooks. Trey Brooks likes him a lot, too. We had a chance to talk to Coach Brooks about you this week. Here's what he had to say about Braden. It's the, really the full package for him. Um, and he, he just loves, loves being up here, loves being around the game, loves learning the game. Um, I, I remember uh, going back between his freshman and sophomore year, um, him just coming in and, and just talking to me about football and how much he loved just just to study the game and to learn about the game. And I thought at that young age, um, that said a lot about him. Yeah, what a cool story. And I mean, when you hear that from your coach, high praise like that, what does that mean to you, man? Uh, it means the world. Uh, and, you know, I trust Coach Brooks so much out on the field, but uh, our relationship off is something that I value a ton. Uh, and I've just been uh, super fortunate to get to be coached by him. Uh, he's one of those guys that is gonna, he's gonna make, he's gonna expect your best each day. Uh, he's not gonna let you just come in any day and uh, not be great. So uh, super lucky to be around him every day. And you know, there's nobody else I want to play for. And real quick, I mean, Mississippi State, they're getting a great quarterback. Excited to see you on Saturdays. Why was the Bulldogs program the right one for you? Man, it just it just checked all the boxes. I mean, you start uh, the obvious one. I think is playing for a guy like Coach Leach. Uh, if you play quarterback, I don't know why you wouldn't want to throw it around that much. No doubt. Um, but, man, it was just so cool being in Starkville. Uh, I really enjoy being around the entire staff. Uh, those guys, they're doing a great job. They're getting the program going in the right direction. I think everybody can, can kind of sense that and see that on, on, when they play on Saturdays. And then, uh, you know, I just I love the people in Starkville. It reminded me a lot of, of being at Rockwall, uh, the support of everybody. No matter what the team does, good or bad, you know, they, they love their Bulldogs. And, uh, it's just something I can't wait to be a part of. It's going to be awesome to see you there, but still some work to be done. Braden Locke, man, hey, congratulations. Good luck the rest of this season, and uh, thank you for joining us here on Inside High School Sports. Thank you. Thank you.